Well, hello everybody, welcome to Chronic Pain Show 258 IWD. Had the announcer here, Ivatopia, alongside Supernova As Griffin's making his way for his world title match, what he won opportunity last week by winning that first world match of Ivan. Mm -hmm. Kyla is in the ring. Uh, she's good by wanting to be uh, wrapping this match, but she says she's going to do it differently to us early. I don't know what that means. Try a different method. And of course, Jess is still apparently at home. Uh, good with morning, sickness. I guess. She said she was ill, so I guess that's what it is. So go, instead of taking over her announcing job, it's like she hasn't done for ages. And here comes the world champion, the Count himself, Von Count. So he can defend the title. His first ever title defense. Here he comes now. As we go to your credits. Yeah. Well, hello there. Welcome to Ivy's Open Wrestling Domination. This is Chronic Pain Show 258. The game is Pro Wrestling X, currently in early access on Steam, where you can buy it. As you can see by the link on the screen, me, Adidopia, and my wife, who is going to be helping out with this, has nothing to do with the game other than buying it and playing it and enjoying it. Same goes for any Fire Pro Wrestling World gameplay that might be used in this video. The link for them is also from Steam, above And also, I would like to add, the opening music you can hear right now is from the title screen from the Pro Wrestling X game itself, as well as being written by Douglas Patrick. Check out his YouTube, and hope you enjoy the show. So as we said, Griffin, there's the World Champ Von Count, with the, obviously the dispute title, World Town on the Line, and then we have Grimmo Pitbull and S Blaze in the men's contract cashing qualifying match for the next pay-per-view, and then we have the women's, what's, wow, it's only going to be Sophie, and Amy in this round. Wow, they've got the easiest one. Everyone's with at least four women going at it. This one's are just one and one. What's your thoughts on that, Simon Tiffy? This match is underway. I don't know how I feel about that. Like, why just the two of them? I'm kind of thinking because Amy's in charge. Oh, <laughs> whipping. This is Griffith's big opportunity to win and the whole time. gonna win it. We're gonna find out if he can get the job done. So far, he's all over Von Campbell. He's reversed him and oh! Under the jaw there. What knee he win? He's not going to single tasks, he's been here. Um, that doesn't mean that he's not going to win this one. Beautiful drop kick there. And last week, if you're not mistaken, he only won the first blood match because you actually smashed Ivan in the face and made him bleed. I heard YouTube been a bit on the rock since then, of what happened. It's an accident. Well, obviously, to enter him, you cost him the world title opportunity. This should be his match in his eyes. Oh, on the concrete, pile driver. Yes, but Ivan also knows that I didn't do it on purpose. I guess he's not much to do with. I guess he just needs to cool down, though. It's Tommy's fault, anyways. Everything is her fault. Well, that's what she wants. She wants to shine it between you two, so she yeah, can see the work. Yeah, and lets her. Oh, blow, 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 blow! It Seven. On him. Eight. It was back in. Okay, so Kyla didn't call for a DQ then, so it seems she's letting this go a bit more. Like she would. I don't know. Griffin did just technically low blow Von Count. I think he got desperate though, and I believe Von Count was trying to keep Griffin outside for the 10 count, and it was the only way he was stopping him by giving that little quick low blow. Von Count then uh, used that momentum. Well, should I say not momentum, but he used, ah, I can't keep him out, then died back in. And obviously Griffin managed to get in the ring in time. But I think Von Count was actually trying to keep Griffin out there for a little quick, easy win. And he wasn't letting Griffin do anything, and that little low blow actually saved the match. He's, got, he's all over him now though. Oh, it's kind of like... No, she said it's rope break, she said it's rope break. I don't know why she's not doing it in the ring. I told She said she's going to do a different method. Although she's walking in front of us like... like I don't like this method. I don't know about you, but it's kind of dumb. I don't know, but she's trying it. Like, she keeps... Like, she's like... In front, she's leaning into the ring to look a little bit, but she's not getting on camera. It's like she's just staying out of it. Well, she's so new at it. She hasn't wrapped that many matches. Obviously, some RKOs there. I don't know. She's trying to do her job. Just saying. Well, she's watching, even though she seems to be wiggling the butt this way for some reason. I don't know what, why she's doing that. She's trying to stay at the camera. Really? Oh, RKO. I have no idea why she's doing that. I guess just so she can get down and see, see the, the, the arms down and the shoulders better. Yeah. Okay, go with that. Oh, beautiful dropkick by Griffin there. He's all over the the, the, the champion. And, oh, was he going? Oh, he blocked him. The champ is back on his feet. What's he going for now? He's caught him and he's got, oh, a vicious. Yes, it's a power bomb. Boom. You know, I know I can't say nothing. He's hooking the leg. One. You need to get your two. priorities straight. What are you talking about? Oh, there's a kick out there. 
And speaking of Von Count, the current world champion is in the back, pre-recorded obviously. We'll be going to an interview with him in a minute before this match. Oh, he's going for another power bomb. Boom! Is he on for another pin before he goes to the back? He is! He's gonna One, out. Two! I don't oh yeah, he was. No, was it? no but anyway, as we said, Von Count, pre-recorded, let go to him. Now see what it's a sale tonight. There's one thing that you can count on tonight is me, my first title defense, retaining my championship belt because I deserve it, I earned it, and that's my belt. Don't matter who comes after me, because I'm the top of this business, and that's why I am the world champion. And after tonight, I polish off this. Who is it, Griffin? It's in the same league as me. It'll be me and you, Gary, and next pay per view. And guess what? I'll be walking away, still the champion. You can count on that. I'm well, back at Griffin to get the um, shot shooter. He might be. Count. Don't be rude. Well, what are you talking about? Von Count was rude. Why? What was rude about what he said? We've got something. Like Griffin's not a threat. Well, it, like I said, if he was going to go, just get him a quick count out. Because Griffin doesn't normally cheat or low blow in any way or form. He's quite a fair wrestler. So I don't think he expected him to do that move to get to get out of that situation. So obviously, before he was just going to get him counted out. And I think it would have worked if Griffin hadn't low blowed him. Griffin doesn't tend to low blow. But I feel Griffin knows this is a big opportunity. He has to go all the way. And he realizes there's no other way out of that situation. Well, he would have been counted out. Because I know some of our refs go to 20, some of them go to 10. It seems to be more up to the ref. But I believe uh, Kylo was going to go to 10. It was, it was hooking the leg. And, uh, yeah, Kyla said, yep, that's a rope break. I feel like she's purposely trying to stay away from the camera. Do you think? I don't know why. Oh, power bomb. So, I don't know. I think she's suspicious. I don't know, but at the moment, Von Count is all over Griffin. Griffin needs to pull some out the bag. This is looking Von Count's match right now. Oh, he reversed him. Good move by the Griffin. And he's giving the power bomb back. Wow, what power behind that. Oh, but the chance back on his feet. So who do you think is going to win? I personally think Von Kaus going to win it because of the experience factor and Griffin's never really got the job done, but I want Griffin to pull it off. Griffin will pull it off. So we'll see. I have all the faith in the world that he will. Oh, he's rolling. Was he going? Oh, sharp shooter. He even hits a champ tap. It's over. We have a new world champion. And a good move as well. Pushed him away from the ropes so we couldn't actually get it. So he's got to crawl the whole side if he wants to reach the ropes or power out of it. Oh, I think he powered out. And Griffin just ended. Like, I feel like Von Count has got the strength over Griffin here, but Griffin's got a bit more... Oh, he's bleeding! The chance bleeding. Griffin's got a bit more a bit more on the speed side. Von Count, of course, has got more experience. Not that much more experience. He's got a good year or two on Griffin. He's one of the first, uh, one of the, one of the first members of the roster. Griffin came in, what, about year two? Uh, winning the Unforgivables? Not Unforgivables. The Unbreakables. Thank you, Unbreakables. Thank you. I have a lot on my plate right now, you know that. Like what? Uh, getting attacked by Grasshopper and his group. You know, with my face with his mask on. You know, I've got a pit between Jess or Zoe. They're both having with my kids. I've still got to obviously spend time with our kid. It's really not that big of a... <laughs> obviously, I put my wages to towards Kyla so she can basically get a chance in this business. You know, you're making this a lot harder decision than what it is. I don't see how. Everybody knows your decision. Just no, they tell don't, everybody. I don't know what it is myself yet. <laughs> oh, the ball put his feet and there's the speed of Griffin over Von Count. How do you not know? Because I, I don't know what's the right Ow. thing to do. Oh, he's on him. Look, he's got him by the head. We're going to see a snake eyes. Boom. Jess has been obsessed with you since day one. Oh, You're wait, wait, one, her. two. Come on, get ah. You still have to kick out then. I thought you want Griffin to win. Oh, I... Dang it. You just told Von Count to kick out. No. Wow, Pouncey's turning on Griffin. No, I thought Griffin had the pen up. It, from my end, I looked See how it's orange and green. And speaking of Griffin, the orange one, he's in the back. Pre-recorded. Let's go to it early tonight. Here he goes. Last week, I got an amazing victory over Ivan Reaver. Unfortunately... Uh, by accidental assist by Supernova Tiffy, but the thing is Supernova Tiffy, I know you didn't do it on purpose, but 
By doing what you did, you allowed me to have my time match tonight, and tonight I'll make you proud. I'm the hardest driver in the business. Tonight I will become the world champion. I'm going to do it for everybody out there, every fan, and especially the sexy, beautiful Simon of Tiffy. That's right, Simon Tiffy. Dedicating a match to you, and I won. I'm dedicating this match to you, and I will become the world champion. Because I am that good, and I deserve it. Well, so we got a bit of a big head there, I see. No, he's got the appropriate size cut. Oh, there's an arms rack to the champ. But you and Jess have been in love forever. Why not just pick her and get it over with? I don't it, see what the big deal is. It doesn't matter if I'm in love with Jess. And then say I'm in love with Jess. It doesn't matter if I am or not. Why would, not? Would it, You're because of everything that's happened. Like, she, the lies she did in the past. And then when I think I can believe it, then other people show I can't. But then I find out I can believe it, then I can't believe I just don't know where I'm at. just don't know where I'm at. Like oh Zoe, God, she, Zoe's never me. done anything m m bad to me in any way. So she's had the safe you option, sure so I should probably that? go to Zoe. But I don't know for sure. Are you sure about that? Yes. Oh, try to get out drank sleeper. He's all over him. You were going to give Jess a chance, like, forever ago. And then... I don't even remember what happened at this so time. So much is the problem. So much has happened. Her mother, Sally, you at one point. But now you finally have a chance to find out if it's real and you're oh, not going to take it. Up. Who does that? Because I'm not about to take it. Then, then of course, Zoe was having my kid coming out. Oh, power bomb, power bomb. He's all over the champion. And she is too, so. Oh, he's going high. 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 Beautiful moonsault! Pin him! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten! <sighs> you, Griffin was too slow making the cover. Too slow making the cover. That was the last man standing match, it would have been over. Come on, Griffin, do better, please. Yeah, great move, but then he was too slow getting over for the cover. You can see he's getting everything he's got. You. you are? Yes, you do better, Griffin, please and thank you. He's all over the champ. The champ's gonna win this. He's gonna make a comeback. Oh, beautiful dragon salute suplex. Can I pick for you? Pick what? No. Why not? It's my decision. But you're never going to pass. I am. I just need time to think about it. Oh! Dragon suplex into the turbo. He hit the, like, the second and the first one on the bottom, didn't he then? It's like boom, boom, boom. So then what's your criteria for picking? I don't know. I'm trying to just... I said, I'm trying to decide between them. Because, like, I've got the safer option with Zoe. Or the, or the, the Amazing Jess, and I don't know which is better right now. So, the safer option or the amazing option? Well, I won't say that's my words, but kind of, I guess, if you want to put it that way. Moves out the back! Oh! Yeah, that sounds like a real a hard bit. question there. Yeah, exactly. That's not what you see my problem is. Oh he's whipping God. him, he's whipping him. And, oh, okay, oh! Come on, Griffin, roll over. One, two, roll, pin him. Two, three. What's he doing? What's he doing? Oh, he's gone for sharpshooter. I don't think I would have pinned him there. Well, he wants to give him some pain. Make sure he doesn't get up again, I guess. He's got cinched in. Look how much he's cinched in there. I think the champ is in trouble here. I'm very surprised there's some grasshopper or tenure coming out to interfere. Oh! Give him time, I'm sure they will. To the knee. Oh, he's up back to his feet then. Oh, nice shot to the head. He's whipping him. He's all over the champ. What's he going to do now? Oh, he moved out of his way. What's he doing? He's got something up the slit. Oh, beautiful running clothesline from behind. Beautiful. He's got extra speed there. Do you see that? Mm-hmm. Quite innovate by Griffin. But I am serious. I mean, I don't know who you're going to pick. I don't. That's the problem. Here we go. Oh, vicious power. What's he doing? Lion soul. Beautiful. Come on, now. One. Him. Come on, he's pinned. Two. Three. Four. Five! Come on, Griffin. He's got it hooked. One. Two. Holy you will jump! Told you he's gonna do it. Griffin's got a job done! Thank you, Griffin. And I'm surprised no one interfered. We got into the match. Nobody interfered too, because they normally do. We got to the match replays. Griffin got the job done. He dedicated the match to you for winning the title. Wow. That's also how I knew he'd win. I crumble. I didn't think he could get the job done. I wanted him to, but I didn't think he could. That uh, teaches them tops people. To try and ruin my face. It teaches you to uh, doubt him. It teaches me to doubt him. No, I doubted him without being tops. It teaches you not to doubt him. Oh, sharpshooter locked in? You know what I meant? 
I'm getting my words confused. See, this is how confusing I am we're trying to pick this situation. If you're getting confused, everyone's confused. Power bomb, beautiful. Oh my god, no, I'm not confused about see, your lion situation. Lion salt there? I'm confused about my situation. And this is, I think, was this, yeah, this is where he hooked the lion up the one, two, three. So Cartel will just ref the world title match and a new champion. So apparently her method worked. Guess we're going to find out. And our next match is obviously going to... Wait. Lucy approached me and said I need to keep an eye on this match. After all, I had put Kyla to ref and she's incompetent. I said I was giving her a chance, but I'm glad I was watching. Why? Did you not DQ that nobody... What's his name again? Giffy or something? How do you even get a title shot? I don't even believe you have a contract here, do you? Well, whatever. What matters is... Kyla, you screwed up, and since there's no one in the building to cancel this out, because Stryker's not here, and he likes it fair anyway, I'm removing the win from Gitty. He was too cute. If you don't believe me, roll the footage above me now. As you can see, blatant DQ. You should have saw that, but you didn't, Kyla. And you better get to the back and sort out that interview with Grasshopper. Don't screw that up, too. Oh, by the way, before you do that, you need to be punished. So I'm going to fine you $50,000 for that screw up there. So I hope you've learned. But for making such a big mistake, Lucy also suggested that you have a bigger punishment. Because more money is no object to you. Or you'll keep doing this. So I will have you ref the main event tonight. And guess what? I'm in the main event. So I can keep a good close eye out. And you better do the right thing out there and do your job properly. And make it easier on the eyes. And you're going to wear this bikini. Okay. So don't screw this up or there'll be hell to pay. If you know what I mean. Oh. And as for the orange man in the ring, you seem a little upset. You should be lucky that I'm even giving you an opportunity here. You had a chance at the big time and you screwed it up. Well, guess what? I'm not heartless. In fact, I believe I'll allow you, because how big my heart is, to enter the contract qualifying match right after this interview. <laughs> wow. What? He won. And Kyla's got put five and five thousand and she's got an interview to do. Wow. Kyla Dream here, about to go into the room once again and do part three of this interview with Grasshopper. Let's go in, shall we? Okay, Grasshopper. I've got something to say to you. Do not be as rough. Do not be as mean as you were last time. I'm the interviewer. Give me that, you stupid wench. You're here to bring the mic. Nothing more, nothing less. Now shut up as I play the next video. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Sorry, Ripper. I'm in the wrong room here. I thought this was my locker room. My mistake, my mistake. Uh, oh, by the way, before I go, I was actually meaning to run into you. So this actually helps. I just want to ask you, how do you feel about being Jason Lackey? After all, he's telling everyone how he is going to win the world title with your help. Even though you're in a match too. And I know if I was in that match, you would be my biggest threat. But according to Jason, you're just a big sack of crap who is only good at following orders and is not and will never be championship material. Again, that's just what I heard him saying. I ain't coming from me, it's coming from him. His lips. And if it was me, I would hate it. And I would want to prove that person who's been saying that about me wrong. No matter what. But I just me after all. Maybe what he said is true about you. I don't know. Anyway, have a good night, Ripper. See you later. As you can see, the seeds were dropped. And this was obviously footage that you didn't get to see. As for the other seeds, with me calling Lucy over during the interview as she passed out, I saw her potential. And all that information. You've basically seen that on the problem already, but that was exclusive stuff. It was there. Basically to give us proof of the Doctor Note more than anything, but then it just shows how great a master plan is and how stupid Theodore is. Last pay-per-view. You know, I paid... You know his name? You probably didn't even ask that as you were trying to break his neck. His name was Bob, and he's a family, and he did the job, and I paid him handsomely. But the thing is, thanks to your actions after the pay-per-view, because you're so insecure, Theodore, so stupid, he is now in intensive care. He has been for the past couple of weeks with a tube through his mouth, feeding him. And all the money I gave him, it was handsomely. I've been informed by his family, unfortunately. He's getting low. His medical bills are piling up. And soon they'll be dipping into their savings. So he did that big. 
job for me where the whole point was to set up for the next few years for him and his family. Have a nice holiday. Something. You just destroyed that. They've been begging me and, and pleading with me to pay, pay him more, give him help. And I'm like, the thing is, he did the job and he got paid for that. What happened after the job was complete was on him and of course you. So they want money, maybe they should be begging you. Going up the Teodor legendary steel tree. They want money, but of course you're too nasty and stupid to help them out. And like I said, I have no guilt in this. I gave him the money for the job he did. Then after the job, you attacked him. You broke his neck. Or at least tried to. You put him in the hospital. You have made his little girl cry. You made his lad lash out and, and basically cut his hand up by smashing a window in anger. You made his wife cry. And they're now fearing for their lives because of lack of money of his medical bills. Or because of you, Theodore. Hope that makes you happy. I know for a fact it makes me happy that you're so stupid and nasty that you allow this to happen. <laughs> and next week, you will hear the final part of my plan that you all seen come together. The pay-per-view for them thickos out there who didn't see it coming. <laughs> and as for you, Kyla Dream, next time you show up next week for the final part of this interview, please take a bath because you stink to high heaven and back. You really do. Wow. And do something about your hair and your face. It just offends me about yuck. Now get out before I slap it off. Well, I've never. He just pushed me out the door. Well, it's Kyla Dream here. Didn't get to ask any questions this week. Unfortunately, I feel like he's being cagey and avoiding me. But the thing is, smell? No way. The only smell in there was lingering when I got in there. Lucy probably already showed up and left before I got there, and that's the smell he's smelling. And as for ugliness, his mask must be on too tight, blurring his vision to think this is ugly. If you want ugly, just look at Lucy. Or Sabrina. <laughs> this has been Kyla Dream. Part 4 of Grasshopper Interview next week. That wow. bitch! Well, calm down, we have How Griffin, Deathblade, Pitbull, and Grimhold. He won that fair and square. Well, he's now in a qualifying match. If he wins this, he goes oh, to the pay-per-view. Win that, and he can have a title shot when he wants. He just had a title shot and won. He's the champion. He's not. He is. Well, they said Kyla should have DQ'd, apparently she didn't. Oh, so. please. Oh, vicious uh, to pit How there. many low blows do people have in this company? A lot. Well, I don't know. Apparently, Amy's put a foot down on them. Oh, please. She didn't even know his so name. She called him Giffen. It's only because her man didn't win. He's not her man, though. It's Von Count. Yes, but isn't he part of Tops? Yeah, that's... Okay. The, yeah, and they... Remember, they technically screwed Jason and got in between Rippers. We just watched that cost Jason the title, who is with Amy. Yeah, and she has some weird vendetta against Griffin, then. I think it's more with Kyle. She also... You see Kyla's face when she went to the bar. She, she owes 50,000 in fines now. 50,000! I don't pay her that much. I don't have that much. I thought it was 5,000. It was 50! Are you it, sure? Yeah, can I get a word from the back? How much did uh, Amy say? Okay, she's confirming she said 50,000. And apparently, if, so, if, if someone keeps questioning them, it, they're going to get fined that too. Uh, so, so, so it's 50,000, right? Mm hmm. Okay. I can run, but she's throwing fines out left, right, and center. Oh, run elbow! I don't know how much money you're gonna have left to pay Kyla after all your kids are born. Yeah, because I don't have fifty thousand. Also, for my money, like I said, after I came uh, after Sally and Ruby saved me, my, my bank account went to zero. Still paying on child support for me. Oh, and here comes Grimhold, pre recording. I think he's saying in the back, and then I, I got her to play too, uh, Kyla. It's Grimhold. Poor, poor little poor Griffin in the match after becoming the world champion having it stolen from you and you're in the match with me of all people with a grim for you and make your night 20 times worse you almost had the best night of your life now it's just a nightmare <laughs> and as for you Pitbull your nightmares are continuing you were cheated out of that title at the last pay-per-view and now your only chance of getting that bell again is through me <laughs> S place. The only competitor in that match that might have a little chance against me while he's trying to destroy the other two. But guess what? 
I'll keep my eyes very focused on you as I rip their necks out and make it grim for you all. I am going to the cashing contract, man. I, Grimhold, will get my world title. Wow. Just one thing about Grim and Grimhold even mentioned that he stole it from him today. Mm-hmm. And now Griffin's chances are slim to none with Grimhold in there with him, unfortunately. Especially with Griffin just wrestled, but with a match of his life. And like you said, we have Pitbull, a former world champion who had it stolen at the pay-per-view. And then we have Griffin, who I'm getting a word, will not go down as a world champion because of the match was a DQ. Please. Even a really... Square. But the record books will not show that. The match is down as a DQ, basically. He finally count did one, the but job, DQ. and then they're acting like he didn't. And now he's got to go through this match straight after it. So he just went for the highs of winning it and dedicating his match to you, and then straight into this cage, trapped in there with Grimhold. Pitbull, who desperately wants his title back to being cheated at the pay-per-view. And of course, S-Place has not been on the show for ages, and we know how good he is when it comes to world titles. Two! Ooh! Grimhold will let a new pitbull kick out of that so he can kick the living snot Where out of Griffin. What? Freaking striker ad, anyways. He would have stopped it. I don't know. She even said he's not in the building right now, so. Where is he? I don't know, but he wasn't here to stop it. I don't have his number. Last time I phoned his number, it said that this number's base been repelled and it's disconnected, so I, I believe Are you he. sure that wasn't him? What? That's what I'm saying. I think for some reason he changed his number and didn't tell me. I don't know why. No, I'm sorry, I'm saying, are you sure it wasn't him telling you that the phone number has been disconnected? No. Why would he do that? Besides, it was a female on the other end. That could have been Gwen. She didn't sound like Gwen, though. It was more, it was more like a Gwen, but high-pitched, so... so you imagine Gwen more high-pitched, it sounded a bit like that. And anyway, boom! Beautiful! Uh, Move to Grimhold, the pitbulls all over him with the sharpshooter. We saw a snake eyes to the big guy. And this blades all over Griffin. So Griffin's got the least chance of winning this, unfortunately, because of what he's just been through. He's tired, he's had a hell yeah, of a match. Which is stupid because he won it. But if he wins this, he would go on to the pay-per-view. If he wins that, he will then be able to cash him when he wants. Are we took him out this place. To have him taken away again? Well, hopefully stupid. Hopefully Strike will be in the building and won't allow it at that point. I feel when Striker's not here, she gets a bit more out of control again. Oh, beautiful move by Pitbull with a roll throw. That nice uh, flying clothesline there. Took S Blades and the big man Grimo down, all in one. Okay, Griffin. Does she basically threaten Kyla that if she doesn't win, that she's gonna punish her even more? I don't know if she said that. She just said, uh, you need to do your job properly. That's what I heard. If you know what I mean, do you jump properly? Yeah, if you know what I mean, meaning she better win. Are you sure? I didn't take it that way. If you're, like, you're more, what's it, the more cynical to people than I mean, I think. That's because... Drop kick! You can't read people at all. You can read loads of people. Really? Then how is it that you've knocked three people up in this business? Hey! There's no need for that. And people are always taking advantage of you. They do not take advantage of Ruby, me. Ruby, Lucy. Oh. Or not Lucy, but what was her name? Sally, you Sally. mean? Sally, yes, thank you. Anyway, here's Pitbull in the back. Let's see what she's to say. Pre-recorded, obviously. Here he goes. I can sit here and whine and whine how I cheated at the pay-per-view over my world title. Cheated out of my great title run. My legacy. But I'm not going to. Facts are fact. What's done is done. I'm going into this match with my eyes wide open. I gotta go through the monster, Grimhold. I've gotta clip the wings of the Griffin, one of the hardest grafts in this business. Lucky for me, he's already had a tough match. That's gonna be a little easier, but I'm soon not gonna underestimate you. And then I've gotta take out S Blaze, that sneaky little son of a gun. And if I can do that, I would then head to the next pay per view. I can then win the cashing contract. Do you remember when I first debuted? I won the cashing contract and cashed in that very night and beat Striker. Maybe we're going to have a repeat this year. Maybe I'll hold on to it when I'm fresher. But the thing is, Von Count, if you're still the champ, I'll always be lurking in your background until I snatch that title away from you. And you know it, I know it, and of course, the crew bloody well knows it. Now hit my music. Pitbull's right, everything said. I didn't said. know it. Did you know it? Yeah. Really? Yeah. And Pitbull uh, is right. He's the first ever contract cashing winner, and he cashed in at that very night beating Striker. He had just won his world first world title. He was up champ for like five minutes because of that. 
It's one of the big reasons they've got such hatred for each other, as well as everything else they've done since then. Oh, and Griffin's crashed. You are? There he goes, Grimhold. What? What? Nothing. Just continue to do what you were doing. Calling the match. Oh, the, the big man came crashing down and Pitbull was caught him into like a tombstone there, mid-air. So who do you think's going to win? No, it's probably not going to be who I want to win. I kind of feel like this favours Grimhold, the big guy, but I would like Pitbull or even Griffin to pull it off. Well, I think it's favouring Grimhold. Griffin pulled it off. But what's the odds that he's going to win Well, it? normally it would be 25% was the odds, but because he's already beaten down, it's probably more like, you know, 33% or something. So that get puts everyone else up a bit, so I don't know what percent that would be, but they're obviously more than 25 each now, at least, aren't they? So, speaking of which, Pitbull's about to climb out and about to win it, unless S. Blaze realises. Oh, at the last second. So I'll say everybody, with exception of, uh, of Griffin, is probably like 30%-ish, 33% chance of winning this. Griffin, on the other hand, probably 20, 15%. And the longer the match goes, the more his percent goes down, in my opinion. What's your thoughts? Oh, yeah. Oh, the I mean, big the man threw him. literally stolen from him. Griffin? And Grimhold, both climbing, both climbing. Oh, there goes Grim. Grim, oh, so close, but Pitbull stopped him. And Pitbull almost took S Blade, who's bleeding from the early snake eyes, out then with that clothesline. Oh, he got In order for Griffin one. to win, he's gonna have to pull something out of his hat. That's amazing. and now the problem is he doesn't wear a hat, so we know that ain't gonna happen. I've never seen him with a hat on in, in my life. Did you realize that that is a one. figure of speech? One more second. Two. Oh, so close. So close. Hmm? Figure, who, who's figuring speeches? Mm. Griffin should be wrestling, not making speeches right now. I hope our kid is smarter than you. Of course, every parent wants their kid to be smarter than them. Oh, beautiful. And it goes to the knee. My like Grimhold. It's taking it to the former champ. The dog's in trouble right now. Oh, he's using speed advantage over Pitbull. And now he's trying to use some strength. And he got him up there. No oh. wonder you got nice three women knocked up. Huh? What are you talking about now? Beautiful line salt there. Took Nothing. Displays I'm down and your intelligence. Home. Well, stop it. That's mean. I'm going to salt yours. That's because you can't even if you tried. Of course I could. Your brain's stupid. Ah, See there. Just salt with your intelligence. You, you brought that on yourself. I'm sorry about that. You brought that on yourself then. Okay, we're going to... If that S-plays. is your insult... <laughs> What would be a compliment? Your brain's smart, see there. We have S Blaze in the back, pretty cool. Griffin's about to climb, he's gonna win it! No, he flies. Yours. And he crashes, and he burns, and here's S Blaze. You're gonna be privileged tonight to witness me qualify for the contract cashing, then go on to win it, and then at my leisure, at my leisure, I will cash in and regain what's rightfully mine the IWD Undisputed World Championship belt. And anybody tries to get my way. There's a run out bro, coming for you. Pitbull's about to climb out! Oh, last second S Blade! Last second! So close! Wow! Oh, Pitbull's down, Grimhold's down. Oh! Come on, Griffin. Grimhold took S Blade's down. Well, it's a long shot, but I hope you win. He deserves to win. He's down after doing that move, so S Blade's got up before him, and he's the one who received the move. I mean, the one that did the move. That's what I said. Oh, drop gets the face, they're all down! All four of them are down. And Griffin, oh, and Pitbull at the same time. Oh, here goes S-Blaze. Oh, he took the Pitbull down. He neutered the doggy. He what? He neutered the doggy. I thought you said he neutered the doggy. I was like, what? Yeah, he neutered the doggy. Neutered. Neutered, that's what I said. Oh, Griffin and S-Blaze both going for it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Griffin, put your leg over, put your leg over. Oh, S-Blaze has gone all down. Mm. What the? What is, what is no, he doing? No! What's he doing? What are you? Whoa! Who was he aiming for? Who was he aiming for? He, he did climb, but then he. He was right there! Holy fudge! I don't know who he aimed for. Wow! Wow! I don't know what to say. I think Griffin lost his marbles. Maybe he's been hanging out too, too much. What are you talking about? Oh! That's how you do a move! A pitbull took all three of them down. One move. Oh, he's got him. Oh, snap mare. First blaze as he got back to his feet. Oh, but he knew S was getting back up. He's gone for him. Oh, he missed. He blocked him. Oh, in the face. 
He blocked. And he whips the dog. And the dog is coming back. Okay, oh my gosh. He's bleeding over the place. Oh, we get a pin. But Grim hold. But Griffin taps first. Is, is, is he going to tap? Well, S place will win. S place will win if he taps. He taps, it's over. Looks like he ain't tap. He releases, he saw what Pitbull's doing. Because he thought Griffin would hang on long enough. Oh, he goes down. He's crashing. Ow! He banged back his head. What falls from one side of the cage to the other? S place is climbing up. Oh, he's hanging on there. They're both trying to stop him. Oh, there goes S-Blaze. Ow! Pitbull's making a climb now. We're going to the back till it's pre-recorded from Griffin. So I'm I guess this... He was able to make one real quick. Well, I was going to say, he probably did this uh, during uh, Kyla's interview. So here he is. Hardest graph in the business here. I had my dream come true. I dedicated the match to Bill Tiffy. I won the World Championship. But then... I had it stolen from me. I don't blame you, Kyla, for that. I've seen plenty of refs let five, six, eight low blows go. And if I didn't do that low blow, he was keeping me out there for the 10 count. He was gonna make sure I couldn't get in. Because he knew he couldn't beat me. And I'm hoping and praying I'll get this match done tonight and go on to qualify for the contract cash in and then win my world championship, my first one. And I also hoping and praying I haven't let down the sexy supernova Tiffy. I dedicate that match to you and technically it's now down as a loss. I'm so sorry. I really hope I haven't let you down. But anyway, I'm going to win this match. And I ain't going to risk dedicating to you after what just happened. After having it stolen from me, I'm going to get the job done. And I'm going to do it. I can do this. I can do this. Oh, honey. It's fine now if he can do it or not. He's about to get, I think, No one's disappointed brain trust me. Well, he's disappointed in himself. No, oh, Pitbull. No. Well, like I said, in record books, it's technically lost now. So, technically, he did. Oh, S. Blaze has got Griffin by the head. Oh, he got caught by Grimhold, though. Oh, he took him down with an arm drag. Got him by the head. Oh, Pitbull's got him, and he caught him in a dragon suplex. Griffin's all over the place right now. Mm -hmm. And looks like we're getting a brain buster. S. Blaze to, to Grimhold. Strong. Oh, Pitbull's starting to get up. Oh, he's decided to try and get out. Oh, he's watching what this place is doing. He's coming back in. You? Yeah. There's a sign over there that says, You're the father of my baby. No, there isn't. Yes, there is. A fan has it. No, it is not. Look! How many women did you get pregnant? Three of you, that's it. Well, that person thinks you are. I don't even know who that is, so they're, they're making it up. How do you know? Because I've never seen it before in my life. There's another sign. Well, apparently, it's not that I'm their father. They want me to be. Mm -hmm. That's what's going on. Oh, look. There's two more. There's four signs. They obviously want me to be. Mm -hmm. My father stood. Oh, yeah. Mm, you could be a father of four more. No, I couldn't, because I've never seen them before in my life. How do you know? You didn't even look at any of them. Because no, it's not them. So let Zoe's out there with a sign. And I think if Zoe would have said it, Zoe. Zoe and is pregnant with your kid. Hence, that's what I said. So unless she's out there with a the sign. There's no one else who could be. Because obviously Jess... Oh, Pitbull, Pitbull. Oh, he's down. Jess is at home, ill. And you're not holding the sign up. Oh, he's in this place. Ow. I think his leg came crashing down on Griffin then too, didn't it? On the way down. Mm -hmm. Got the blood in the ring. Oh, that's going to be Griffin's. Back to his foot. There's a nice little kick there to S. Blaze. Who hits him with his right elbow? And that's. Oh! I was going to say that's his finishing move. He's not won multiple world titles with that. Then he got the caught one from Grimhold himself. And now Griffin, if he taps it over. Oh, did you see that? Pitbull, like, threw S. Blaze in the air, and, like, caught his leg and slammed him down. I think he even crashed him down on top of the back of. Uh, Griffin, who was inside that sharpshoot at the time. Oh, what the, oh Pitbull's going to climb and win! Pitbull's going to win it! Yep, Pitbull's won. Oh, wait, what's he doing? No. Oh! Why do people just give up the title shot? Ow! I think uh, that's what's kids been heading the way down, too. I don't know, I think he was climbing out and he lost his balance there. 
And there goes Grimhold. Is he going to splash Griffin on the way back now? He is! Ow! I think Griffin's like three people land on him now in that last, what, about 30 seconds a minute? But somehow he's back on his feet. He looks dazed though. Oh, he's trying to stop Pitbull. And Esplay's trying to climb. Okay, he's the extra run. There goes Pitbull. Is Esplay's going to make it? Oh, no, there. Oh! He needs to climb now. They collided. They collided. They're like kaleidoscopes then. They collided. Why are you going all the way over there? To kick Esplay's apparently. And he's picking Esplay's up. And he got caught by Grimhold. He's giving him a power driver. Ugh. I think he's a bit dazed on his feet at the moment, Griffin. Mm -hmm. He kind of don't know where he was, so he went over to the S place and trying to climb out. He's down again. There's a run elbow, and Pitbull blocked it. And now to hurt your arms, are blocking one from Griff uh, Grimhold. And a second one he blocked. Oh, he's, he's catching S place there. As Grimhold's got whipped. Oh, beautiful drop kick by Pitbull and Griffin. Is, is he going to climb? Oh, he is. Oh, so is it the spitball. Could come down to chance. There's no chance to wrestle in this. There's Pitbull, Griffin, Grimhold, and of course, S Blaze. Oh, Griffin won again. I don't know. He, he's against Pitbull. Who gets there first? He's lower than Pitbull right now. Is he? Let's find yeah, out. He, Pitbull was still climbing. I th yeah, I think you're right. The refs uh, giving to Griffin. So now two he, times in a row. So he's going to get the pay per view. He's going to win that match. He win the contract cash in, then he can have a title match anytime he wants. Wow, he got the job done. Twice. Yeah, one night. Like that. I don't know what he was playing at there. Like there's no one in the middle ring. I don't know who he's diving at. This is where people got taken out. I'm so proud of Griffin. And that was amazing move by Pitbull to call three of them out. But he still didn't get the job done. Griffin did. I feel everyone but Pitbull underestimated him. And Pitbull tried to use his speed at the end, and somehow Griffin had a bit of extra speed in him. I also think he's slightly taller than Pitbull. I think that can advantage in at the end. We have the women's contract cashing match qualifying match now. Amy and Sophia going at it. And. Oh, yeah! The that she was forced to yeah, she put that ref this one, didn't she? She was doing the interview in the back. So here comes Kyla. That's part of her punishment as well, so 50,000. Here comes Amy. So I think Amy's. Amy's uh, feels like she's probably got this in the bag. So we're going to find out what goes on. She does it, she's going to punish Kyla, man. Oh, well, oh, she's telling her something. What's that about? Yeah, really, that I need to win, and if not, you're going to get fined more than $51,000. I know. How can you hear that from here? I can't make out what she's saying. Here comes Sophia. You can beeline for the, the ring. One of her biggest matches here. She can beat the boss, and then go on to the final in the pay per view and win the, the first ever women's contract crash in. Okay, we're underway. Oh, good take. I think Amy's gonna win. Let's find out. You never know, we don't want to count Sophia. How should I get the job done? Oh, look at that! Sophia should probably win, but Amy's gonna be the one who takes the cake. Ooh. Is it cheesecake? I have some. Oh, he's. What the? Her leg! That was quick. No, it's not over, but her legs hurt! I think she like put it out of the socket or something, or. Chipped it or something. Look at Amy's face, she's in a lot of pain. Sophia goes right legs, you might actually tap. Oh, see, see the squishy pain when she pushed her off then, using that leg. I feel she's desperately trying to keep her away from her leg at the moment. Oh, and, and Sophia's making a run. It's not good for Amy's leg right now. Look, she's trying to walk it off. You can tell she's in a lot of pain right now. Yeah. I mean, I would be too. Oh! She's on it! She tapped! Stop being in it! She did it! She's not releasing! Uh oh. Sophia's not releasing it! But she advances! And Kyla's kind of standing there. Is she like smirking? Mm, yeah. 
Wow, Sophia's advances! You bitch. I warned you, Kyla. Restart this match is a handicap. Sophia and Kyla teaming versus me, Sally and Ruby. What? Handicap match? Hey, it's your ex-wives. Haha, <laughs> very funny. Oh, it is. <laughs> okay. <laughs> With Ruby and them and Amy team in handicap. Didn't you say we Kyla too? Yeah. Oh yeah, we got the, the, new, the other rock out. Isn't that April? Yeah, April or the refs to come out. Sally's enjoying herself. So is... Oh, it's Shiger! I thought he wasn't here today. It looks like he's just arrived. What's this about? Well, who's been a bad little girl while I've been away? Hmm. Well, the way I see it, this was basically a crap main event. So I will allow this match but I am cancelling the restart, meaning Sophia advances. But I'm also going to tweak this match. Let's make it a three-on-three -three tornado match. And here's your partner. Partner? That's good for Sophia. Yeah, she advances, and it's her, Kyla, and a partner. Who's the partner, though? Oh, Gwen! Should have seen that one coming. Well, I guess she's arrived. She's arrived. She gets to have a match now. That was quick, though. Amy didn't do much. And remember the... Uh, Last pay per view, wasn't it? Striker and um, Gwen, obviously, versus Ruby and Steel. So, obviously, she's getting some, I guess. And we know neither of them like Amy very much. So we have a tornado going on. Oh, double team! The Sally there. So whose team do you think will win? I don't know, because technically, if you go for Amy. Her leg, look what she's going for, is, is, we know she's already in pain. She expected obviously the other two to beat Kyla down and Sophia, didn't she? And she'll come in and probably sweep for the victory. I mean, that's what she thought was going to happen. Oh! Ruby got thrown out. Of course, because uh, Ruby's got the power, I think she's a powerhouse in there. So the weakest ones are Kyla. Well, yeah, and she's. Ruby. Or not Ruby, but. Um... Amy. Yeah, I would say. Because Kyla, obviously, she's... This is technically the first official match. Oh, we're going back to listen to the star. Oh, double team there. Wow. It's the star. Star is right, the star is bright. The star wishes that Jess would start feeling all right. I know what you mean, star. Last week, I gave 50 beef bologna, cheese, ham sandwiches, and... It didn't make it feel better. So I upped the ante this week before I came to the show. I left the 100 beef bologna cheese sandwiches on a doorstep. I also rung the bell, sent a little message to her phone. Come down, you have a big surprise. And on top of that, and obviously I didn't have just a special ham to make it even more spectacular. So when she got there, not only would she seen a hundred of them, they were all wrapped in, especially printed out pictures of Ivy Topia's face, because I know how much she likes him. So I thought that would put a smile on her face. Unfortunately, I had to dash, because obviously I was running late for the show. I thought I had a match tonight, but apparently not. What the? Do you mean pictures of me wrapped mm -hmm. in sandwiches? And he just left them on a doorstep? No, that was sweet. That's weird. Why did he do that? She's going to think you did it if she didn't see him do it. He said he texted her, so it was coming from his phone, so she'll know who it's from. Didn't she lose her phone? Oh yeah. I don't know. Apparently she's got a new one and he's got the number. Oh, double team to Oh look at that to Kyla, ow! I think it's pretty sweet. Cause he also knows that you're gonna pick her. No one knows that yet, because I haven't decided. Oh take down to Sally. Oh kick in the face. You would have picked Jess over Sally without either one of them being pregnant. So why Sally isn't pregnant, what are you talking about? Sally Zoe. I hope Sally's not pregnant. The last thing you need. Yeah. Right. Oh, Sally's it's got oh oh reversal to Ah Kyla's in trouble. Ow. Okay, it's Ruby in front of us. Let's go back in the ring. Is this elimination or is it just one fall? I don't know, because Strike and tweaked it. I guess it's gonna be whatever the ref says. I guess we'll find out. If it's over with one pinfall or not. But this is technically Kyla's first ever match, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Even though she still doesn't have a contract, so... Oh, he's got Sally by the hair. 
Was she setting Sally up on the, the top turn button? And she oh, the wrist again! Ow! We just saw an ankle lock on Ruby who powered out of it. She's stuck oh, on the knee. Top because she keeps having it reversed. Oh, like a massive defy driver on FU there by Amy. Oh, she's, she's got a fork, people! Okay, Rev, you should be pulling that off and not just counting. Oh, she told the rest she didn't have it. And she pulled it out again. Isn't that the same thing that she got on Griffin for doing? No, that was a low blow. And that's not... And did you see Sally, too? She just basically... S oh, fire! Nunchucks. Uh, brass nuts, sorry. Um, Kyle in the face. And if I'm not mistaken, during... Uh, the the star interview. Oh, a fork fork by Ruby this time to Gwen. That uh, that Kyla also um, brass knocks Amy in the face, and then she kind of mm -hmm. oh she did it again. Wait, 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 where's your point? It. Mm. It's the same one she pulled out earlier. That I was just talking about, and she just did it again. My point is, she's cheating. I guess Amy's allowing it to go more but we're being in the match. With April's the ref. Two. Oh, close. Oh, she's chewing on Ruby. Nummy, nummy. Oh, she got kicked in that thing. It's, it's the no chucks in there. Wouldn't that gone up and hurt her? Ow! Why can't it be? They're just, look how skin tight they are on her. I don't see bulges, do you? Oh! She's copying Gwen's finisher. She had a rope break. Though. Yeah, it was a rope break. It was, but she do hit a finisher on her. Like it's skin tight, what she's wearing in it, so like, I don't see any bulges, do you see any? Mm -mm. I'm not looking at her Well, you, you kind of, you're trying to look for them nunchucks, not nunchucks, the, um... Knuckle, brass knuckles. Thank you, the brass knuckles, you've got a lot, don't you? It's part of the job. No, I don't. Because I don't see any lumps on the butt, or any lumps on, under the front bit, or at the side. So they must be somewhere else. Yeah, oh, like them forks. They must be hungry. Apparently for a striker flash. What would the canvas do then? Who knows? Oh, she's got Amy locked in. Uh, and then hurt knee. Oh, she, they almost broke it up just in time for her. Your kids kept me up all night last night. What do you mean? Like, your kid is kid. We only have one. Okay. Yeah, I think it's a kid. I think it's an S. Oh, he's chewing. Oh, and we're getting a choke there. Oh, a, 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 a cross race chicken wing then. Sophia was due to Ruby. Yeah. Kyla's down. Oh, we got another four. How many four can we this match now? Yeah. I can remember. So far, two, but they've been forking a lot of people. That's what I, I don't think Sally's forked anybody yet. No, not yet. Oh, look at by the face. Look. Oh, that's a low blow, wasn't it? Can he's going high? The double team! Oh, look at look at this! There's Sophia! Oh! Ow! Striker! When Striker just technically saved Kyla and she got dropped on the head. She was being suplexed and she broke it up and, and Amy dropped on the head. Oh, oh, look at this! Look at this! Oh! Yeah, German! Like a double! Oh, she had a crippled cross face on uh, Amy then. I feel Sally and Ruby are destroying Sophia. Yeah. And... Uh, Amy's gonna get destroyed by uh, at least walls anyway, by uh, Kyla and of course uh, Gwen. Now they're kind of broken up a bit more. Oh, she's punching her out. See, so look, like you see Sally's butt there. There's, she doesn't have any nunchucks in her. I'm brass nuts, sorry. So yeah, smooth it was. There's no brass nuts. I'm not looking. Well, they were sticking in her face. We had to look then. One. I didn't. Well, heading now, so I gotta look at these things. So. Oh, spear. Her. No, we're going. No, you're not cheating. No, no, they're not cheating. Oh, see, they come out again! And then they disappeared again. Again, it's so smooth. I crumble. These, these are going like hell and back by each other. Mm -hmm. Oh, she's beating the snout. Sophie is beating the snout out, Sally. Hopefully they will, but we'll find out. Oh! Again with the knocks to Sally! And again, she disappeared in not little smoothness. She's sick on her face! She just signed up for Ace. What? Sabrina? Sabrina coming out for? Hopefully she's gonna She's not gonna go after Kyla. Remember, she kind of made that remark about her earlier in the night. Mm. She did, did she? Oh, she's gonna get revenge on her for what she said. Did she call her ugly or something? Yeah. Smelly. Smelly, that was it. 
Ow! So I don't think she's out here to help Amy. She's just kind of come out here to get a Kyla. So if he's seen Kyla getting tapped, it's her partner. She's just attacked her. I don't think she's actually out here directly to help Amy. She just wanted to get a Kyla. Oh, she just broke up. She, it's a good cross face of Ruby. Oh, what a move by Sabrina! See, again, you can see uh, the smooth butt of, of Sabrina. There's no uh, uh, foreign objects in yeah, there. I'm not looking at that. I'm looking at everything else. I am too. It's very smooth. Oh, what a move! Whoa! Hey, she really going at it. Yeah. Ow. Finn. Finn Mac there on the concrete. Oh. She's leaving now. She's done her damage. See if they can pull it out. Oh, no. Kyla's got... Oh, no. She's going after her. Um, if they don't get in. Oh. She missed her. 14, 15, 16. Oh, she got back in the ring. She kind of left her partners there. A bit of experience there on her part. Crumble Crush face. Got in the ring. Got Crumble And Amy. Amy tapped! And look at her rupees! Basically, get, I don't know if she's tapping herself. Mm. And she's not releasing Amy! And Gwen just, you see, she's telling Ruby and them to back off. She's not releasing the boss! She's still got it on her! Well, not the smartest study that girl's ever done. But... Look at the blood! The people are, are zooming in on it! Hi, Karumba! Can we get a better look at this? I feel like get, get, Gwen oh. is kicking her. I think she is! She's kicking her in the arm and she's warning Ruby and them to stand back. Hi, Karumba! Look at the pain! Ow! The determination of Kyla's face! Are they gonna, mm -hmm. anyone gonna stop it as we go to match replays? Nope. Wow! Like, that was Amy's downfall. So she's tapped out twice tonight. Yeah. And Sophia... Advances for, uh, for the contract cashing. And I was on her knee, and then Kyle was ripping her face off at the moment, and her neck. So a striker came out. And restarted the match. No, he didn't restart the no, match. Not restart. He, oh, he basically. He unrestarted yeah. it and made a new match. He unrestarted it and allowed this match to continue and added. made a tornado, and he, of course he added Gwen to it. And of course they won. Uh, this match was back and forth. And Kyle got her first victory. And she's the one that actually made them tap. Mm -hmm. I guess she's going to be happy with that. I don't think Amy's going to be. But Amy's got to be watched what she does. If she comes out and tries to restart or something, I think Sarah's still going to stop her. Well, there's the Falcon. Well, one of the many we saw in this match. Well, it's poked to the eyes. This move was incredible, though. What Sally and Ruby did. Isn't Ruby at the end of like, eh. No. Sophia, that was pretty good. Unfortunately, not good for Sophia. Match. It was a really good match. Very competitive. Like this, triple German. The strength of Gwen, man. German, her old partner, mm -hmm. who had hold of um, the opponent. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Look at this move by uh, Sabrina. Boom to Kyle. That's where she threw her out. Are they going to replay the double jump? Look, boom, boom. Mm -hmm. That's where she was counted out, and look, as soon as she gets back in, she like misses and it goes around Amy, it catches her off guard. You know, as we see uh, Gwen yanking on Ruby. What a match. Anyway, like and subscribe to that good stuff. I've been head announcer, I have a topia. You've been. Supernova TV. See you next time. Bye, Bye everybody. Bye.